when I walk outside here and I look up, um, I can point to pieces in the sky where some big event happened in the world of aviation, right? Where the space shuttle would set up for its final approach for landing, where the sound barrier was first broken, where Virgin Galactic, uh, you know, completed its first uh, commercial flight, you know, back and forth to space. As a pilot, I can fly in that exact piece of airspace where that actually occurred. You know, I've flown somewhere on the order of about 80 different airplanes. Uh, every time I climb up into an airplane, it's like the first time for me, every time. Test pilots are, we typically recruit from folks that have engineering backgrounds. So something in aeronautical engineering, electrical engineering, mechanical or astro engineering. Uh, there's test pilots, there's test engineers. We both apply to the same school. We consider ourselves very uh, blessed to be able to do this for our nation. Um, and because that community is so small, we consider ourselves brothers and sisters. Working at Edwards is a fantastic opportunity for a historian. You can't throw a rock here without it hitting either something new and incredible that someone is working on today, or hitting a place or a building where someone did something incredible 30, 40, 50, 60 years ago. This hangar was built for the XP-59, America's first jet. Now it is sitting right next to the emerging technologies Basically, anything to do with America's aircraft, it gets tested here. We have a lake bed that is the largest geographic lake bed in the world. Uh, and so it is a natural landing surface uh, with runways that go for miles and miles and miles on it. And the fact that we're in the middle of the Mojave Desert gives us the ability to do things here that you can't do in Boston, Massachusetts, or New York, or Los Angeles. It has a legacy to it that is very, very special, not just in the world of, of the Air Force, but in the history of flying, <laughs> right? Uh, and so for all those reasons, when people get assigned here, I, I like telling them that not only have you been assigned to a base, but you have now been brought into this story, this, this, this legacy that you get to claim a little bit of piece of that. You come here because you want to be on the frontier of something. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.